My name is Kathy O'Grady. We have a foundation uh, called the Sophia's Angels Foundation. Um, where we just do random acts of kindness for anybody and everybody. We don't, we're not specific with anybody, whether we're giving coats to the homeless or leaving blankets around for them, or hats or gloves, um, whether we're taping quarters onto gumball machines for kids or the electric rides for them. Um, we've had some people go out and purchase toys for a, the park. They go to the dollar store and they purchase balls, bubbles, um, chalk, and we leave them around parks for kids to take and play with. I was giving a homeless person, this, this, this girl, um, she was probably in her early 20s, and I gave her a, a jacket, and she said to me, it was almost 4 o'clock in the afternoon, she said, you're the first person who actually made eye contact with me. She was more mm. appreciative of the eye contact than she was with the jacket. When I leave the house to do these things, my husband's like, okay, are we coming home with anybody today? <laughs> are you bringing anybody home, hon? <laughs> um, I, I just feel so bad to see that something so small, that we get so busy and so engrossed in our own lives that we don't notice that other people are hurting around us. And something so small, and that's what makes me upset, as a, just a smile or an acknowledgement, it's all it takes. It's all it takes. That's somebody's daughter, that's somebody's son, that's somebody's dad, that, you know, that's somebody's child. That's you know? true. That's what gets the tears. We have um, angels, as they're called. They're called Sophia's Angels all over the U.S. Um, we have Canada, um, England, and I've sent some cards to Australia wow. as well. And it's in honor of your mother? Sophia was my mom. Yes, mom passed away from breast cancer mm. um, 17 years ago. And all it took me this long to find out, I wanted to keep her memory alive. I wanted to um, carry her legacy. She always did for others, even if she didn't have. We didn't have a lot, and the little that she did have, where she would help the people that were moving from Greece here. We live in a big Greek community. Mm -hmm. So the little that we did have, she split in half and help them. And I always wow. felt that it doesn't matter how much you have, you can always help somebody else. I'm seeing her actions, I felt that if I follow through with what she started and do that, others will see my actions and they will also follow through. And it, it has exploded um, with so many people that are following my lead of or joining whatever the causes that I'm doing, people will join in and help. Thank you.